Welcome, everybody, back again for more Beyond the Brick goodness here. I'm going to be playing some Lego Harry Potter years one through four because uh, they came out with some images for some new Harry Potter sets. And I'm like, man, those look really cool. So I'm excited to talk about those and play the game here on this Wednesday after to, when Thursday. Today's Thursday. Wow. Okay, my name is Brian Saviano, Bricks O'Brien. Thank you for being here on Beyond the Brick. Shout out to the Hanlon brothers for letting me do this once again. And also a shout out to Clone Army Customs, who are today's sponsor for the live streams. They wanted to uh, support the content by letting you know that they are the place to go for any custom clone things you might need. Mini figures, accessories, and the like. So check out the link in the description below if you want to see more about what they have to offer. They are uh, one of the top places to go. You already know who they are, all right? So make sure you check them out. It helps us uh, support the stream. And uh, yeah, so I'm going to get into it. I haven't played Lego Harry Potter in a long, long, long time. There's the Flying Fort Angela. Uh, shout out to Lucas, um, our toy world, Flick Bricks. Alexander Cooper, Eli, David Sorodin, Devin Dupree, Optimus Prime, William, and the like. All right. So uh, that's what's going to be going on today. Thank you for joining me. That's some hype. You can't really hear the hype, I don't think. No, not really. I'm going to, I need to figure out what the audio, hold on, lower this a smidge. Okay. Uh, let me know how everything else sounds otherwise. Okay, ladies and gentlemen. But uh, let's jump into the game. Hey, there it is. There it is. Hopefully it looks good. Harrison says, we don't see anything. I hope you see something now. I certainly hope you do. So uh, what's going to happen is I'm going to play through years one and two and kind of take my time with Harry Potter uh, years one through four. And then probably on the next stream, I'll do, uh, you know, three and four because three is my favorite movie. So... I'm excited to uh, talk about that more in depth. So yeah, um, any uh, likes you have on the stream help support it and convince uh, the Hanlon brothers to let me keep doing this. So uh, any support you can show via that way or through Super Chat is certainly helpful. But if not, a like is all uh, you can do, then that's totally good. Um, so hopefully you're all doing well today. Um, yeah, I do not speak French. Unfortunately, so, yeah, sorry about, uh, about that one there. Uh, Brian, I know it's really early in your video, but can you please play Jedi Fallen Order? No. Uh, no. Um, you guys can see the live stream, right? This is working properly. Everything's working good. Yes, it is. Oh, there it is. Okay, good. Just want to make sure I got out my phone. Uh, this is going to be fun. I think it's going to be the most fun you've ever had all day. Um, considering that Harry Potter has new sets coming out in August, uh, it's going to be very very good and uh here's the shameful plug while we re uh, see harry potter get left at the doorstep like i did as a child uh that if you want to see me play video games i live stream three times a week on twitch.tv slash bricks o'brien 
And this is a set we're getting in a couple months. Oh boy. Get excited. The Dursleys. Uh oh. It's just so weird seeing like all of the, the old Harry Potter minifigures and how they compare to the new ones. It's so interesting, you know? Uh, let's see. Uh, yes, yes, Harry. Uh, how was your day, Brian? It's good. I have a nice coffee. I'm ready to rock and roll. Uh, you may end up having to uh, refresh the stream if that uh, is the situation, if you can't hear or anything. I believe I can hear and everything is going relatively well. Let me make sure here on my end, at least. I trust Vision Bricks, so if Vision Bricks is here, he can trust me with that. Oh yeah, I can hear myself, yeah. So if you can't hear the live stream, that's your fault. That's your awful internet talking. Um, <laughs> and thank you, uh, Vision Bricks, for taking care of these kids in the chat. It's greatly appreciated. There's some high porns there for you, buddy. Lego's making a Hedwig a bust for August. No, they're making a Hedwig set. It's not just Hedwig's head. That'd be kind of weird. But it's his entire body. Wings and all. So, yeah. Uh, is this game worth it? Technically, no. So I ended up buying this on Steam because I didn't have the Harry Potter collection on the Switch or any other console. But what you can do is get this game on the Nintendo Switch or on Xbox One or something like that, and you can get the complete collection. Why is Harry Potter somersaulting as his main attack? Who knows? So that is the actual better investment for you in terms of uh, financials. So if you want to uh, do that, I'd recommend you do that. Okay, so Hagrid can use magic, obviously. And this one is a bit more comprehensive than LEGO Star Wars A Complete Saga. So, in case you're curious of the case between the two, uh, this does have a lot more going on to it, so it's pretty good. Um, will you stream LEGO Star Wars The Clone Wars? I haven't seen LEGO Star Wars The Clone Wars, so I don't know how much uh, information I'd be able to bring to that if I did end up playing it. So, I'm going to stick with Harry Potter for right now, especially considering the new sets have been announced. And then probably for years five through seven will be, okay, no, there we go. Uh, years five through seven will be when the sets come out, if I'm still doing these streams, who knows, you know? Uh, this, is the, this is the, I watch one of your videos. Well, thank you, Nash. And hello, Diagon Alley. Really makes me wanna go all the way back to, um, to Univer, not Universal. Yeah, it is Universal, Universal Studios. There we go. There's a, a piece of the shield there, the crest, the Hogwarts crest. M yeah, really makes me want to go back. Did my game just crash? Well, there's Ridley. My game just crashed. I guess... <laughs> I guess they really didn't want me... I guess, like, Hagrid's like, ah, I guess we're not, uh... We're not, un uh, we're not sweeping up. Can we get some Fs in the chat for that one? I have a super powerful PC. Not to gloat, but like, how does the game, cr this game is 15 years old. How does that happen? Jeez, all right. Hey, I'm booting it up back now, all right? Booting it back up now. My progress, look at this ladies and gentlemen. My progress, 0.0%. .0%. Haven't seen that in a long time. Let's hope that doesn't keep happening, right? I actually did just order the, um, <laughs> I ordered the- I have to do the hint intro again? Uh. So I actually just ordered the um, Harry Potter collection on Switch. Uh, and that's getting shipped. I bought it on eBay. Because Amazon orders are taking forever to get in, obviously. And they're prioritizing things that uh, are essential. And Lego Harry Potter on the Switch is not essential. So uh, it's going to take a while. But yeah, eBay it should pop in uh, a little quicker. So I hope you really like this intro chat. Hope you really like it. Mini Fig McGonagall's cat, maybe. Let's certainly hope so. Um, it isn't compared to the Lego guys. Yep, yep. So how's everybody doing today? What do we um, what do we think about these Harry Potter sets? What do we think of these? There's my best friend Craig. Hello. Yo, a wizard, hi. I'm a what? 
You're a wizard, Harry. What? Give us a hot take on the new sets while the intro runs. All right, so the the, the new the new Harry Potter. I'm just gonna go to full screen here. The new Harry Potter sets are absolutely fantastic. They invoke the movies perfectly, and now that they have the actual movies to work with that are completed, instead of working with preliminary images or concept art or something like that. They're working with the movies that have already been established so they can put so much more care and, and consideration into the actual sets now that the movies are long over. So they have a full lineup of sets that they could work with for uh, you know years to come. So now we're starting to like catch up on where the sets, like previously that came out, like all the different Hogwarts sets, the Burrow, Privet Drive and all that, they've kind of caught up on a lot of the things that they did years ago with new iterations of that. So I'm curious to see what they do going forward if they do things that maybe haven't appeared in Lego form, Lego Harry Potter form yet. But there's still things like the Shrieking Shack that still have not been done. I think that's very obvious for them to do. So let's hope that something like that happens eventually. But um, there's a lot that they can still work with for sure. But as the movies get darker uh, into the franchise, it gets a little more difficult to, to work with. So I don't know how, uh, how well that's going to go, but we'll see. So finally, back to it again. Let's hope that Hagrid doesn't, <laughs> doesn't <laughs> crash the stream again. Um, one of these streams that Star Destroyer is going to fall. It's not. It's actually uh, the exact opposite of that. It's actually going to ascend into the sky. And into the high heavens. Unless I, like, intentionally threw it off my shelf, that's probably not going to happen. So, I really want to know why that crashed. <laughs> that is so weird. So, so weird. Um, what do you think of the Universal Lego do in the movies? So, that is something I really... I'm not even... I'm not bothering with this. Nope. I'm not bothering with it. I'm... Listen, I love you, Diagon Alley and Universal. Not here. I got a vendetta now. I'm not... I'm not for it. All right. So the interesting thing with the Universal thing, I really wanted to talk about that in the um, the live stream on Tuesday, but unfortunately we were so enraptured in conversation that I didn't get a chance to talk about it with uh, any of the guys. And I think it like I'm sure we'll talk about it next week or something. Which we should like. There's a whole lot of Lego news that's come out, but with that and that just exploded. Cool. Um. I'm cur my, my quick thought is I'm curious to see what, uh, what LEGO and Universal would do differently as opposed to the partnership with WB. So clearly, there must have been some reason that they're like, all right, we would rather see what happens with uh, only goblins can open these locks. Hello? Hey, man. Uh, can I get in? I'm an adult. Maybe? Yes. Um... Like, clearly there's something that Universal can do that Warner Brothers didn't want to do or couldn't do or contracts and blah, blah, blah. So I'm curious to see what they would actually come up with that's different, you know? Uh, I'm looking in at future Harry Potter sets, and they have Lego Patronus or Patroni, IDK. They do. So the Patronus... Patronuses? Patr yeah, I don't know what the plural is. But uh, <laughs> that's something to ask J.K. Rowling. But there's... Um, a lot of things that they have done with those sets that they haven't done before. So, like, the Patronus... Mu the multiple Patronus that are in there. Um, that is certainly new. And he has the key. Thank goodness. Look at these goblins. They look so old. So, they're, they're doing new things as long as, like... As well as remastering those older things, too. So, they're doing a lot of unique stuff with uh, the newer sets. I'll bring up the subject of Universal on LEGO Tuesday. Hey, man. Craig, that's why you're my best friend, Craig. You actually pay attention, and you contribute to the conversation, and I appreciate that. So, there's a, there's a whole slew of topics. I need to know when Guardian Leviosa to build objects. Well, that's not your de department. When Guardian Leviosa. Um, how long will this stream be? I'm probably going to do uh, movies one and two, because I'm assuming these take a little while longer to do. And then I'll finish uh, three and four next t uh, Thursday. So uh, try to evenly pace out everything here. Oh, hi. In there? Cool. 
Lots of cutscenes here. Uh, how old is this game? I think 2005? Maybe? It's definitely more than 10 years old. It's definitely way more than that. Di uh, dire Murd. Dire Muid? So, yeah, this is one of the older LEGO games, but it's a lot more sophisticated in terms of uh, gameplay and everything else than um, like a Star Wars Complete Saga. So it's a bit more interesting in that regard. Uh, RJK says, I have this game. Well, I do too. That makes two of us. Here we go. Get back, dragon. Thank you. It's like 15 years old. Yeah, so they came out with the uh, Lego Harry Potter collection uh, relatively recently. It's your gold, Harry. Your gold. It's your family's fortune. You are rich forever, sir. Even though that won't technically matter. It came out in 2010. I do not... I don't believe you. That Lego Harry Potter years 1 through 4... Like, years 1 through 4, not the collection. 1 through 4 came out in 2010. I don't believe you. I think it was like 2008, now that I think about it. Uh, do you like Harry Potter? So, it's actually funny. I, I ended up being on the Harry Potter hate, hater train for so long. Because I'm like, Harry Potter's for nerds. Never got into it. And then that was because when I was younger, they had one of the movies in theaters. And my grandmother offered to take me and my cousins to go see it. And my mother was like, oh, you wouldn't like that. That's stupid. And so I never went. And then I ended up watching one and two years afterward. One and two are definitely more so kid movies than the other ones. And then way down the line before Fantastic Beasts came out, came out, came out. I ended up watching uh, Seven in theaters at leading up to Fantastic Beast, which made no sense at all. And Vision just said it, it, uh, it did release in 2010? Wow. That's the first level complete. That is incredible. Wow. Jeez. I, I, time flies, dude. 10 years ago? Man, I'm old. Um, Niels Thomas Boy Kirk is watching from Denmark. That's hype. Shout out to Denmark. That's where a lot of these bricks originate from, or the idea of them, at least. We're going to continue the story. So when Fantastic Beasts came out, I ended up seeing it opening night because I'm like, oh, this looks interesting. And I saw it and I fell in love with it. So then I went back and I watched uh, number three. I saw, you know, uh, Prisoner of Azkaban and I, uh, that was, that's my favorite one. That is like by far and away my favorite of the Harry Potter movies. The fact that you think the movie ends with, you know, them being in the hospital room and it's like, oh no, we're going back in time. It's a whole different thing. It just totally threw me off and I was like, man, this is really good. And then I fell in love with the whole series after that. It was really just, um, just like a, a avalanche of Harry Potter goodness after I watched uh, three. And then Fantastic Beasts I really like. So, I mean, I really like them. I, I, I know it doesn't have the same type of magic for a lot of people that, you know, Harry Potter has, but I like seeing the beasts and all that, you know? Yeah, that really caught me off guard. Yeah, exactly, Vision. Same thing. Totally. Uh, anyone else from Scotland? Not me. Uh, the crest you forgot when the game crashed. Yeah, well, apparently anything involving that beginning section there is going to make the game crash, so I'm just like, I just walk by it. Don't even bother. Whatever. Uh, what do you think about the new LEGO Star Wars game coming out this year? It's probably going to be good, Kiefer. Um, I certainly hope it's going to be a good distribution of each of the different movies between the Skywalker saga. So there's a good amount of Phantom Menace and then, you know, all the rest of the movies. Obviously not including Rogue One and all that because it's a Skywalker saga. So here's hoping it actually turns out pretty comprehensive in terms of stuff to do. Cactus is from California. Where are you from again? I am from the North Shore of Boston, Massachusetts. I make that very aware every time I do a live stream or a piece of content, I feel like. It's like, you know, I take a lot of pride being from where I'm from. Uh, Nicol Nicholas is from Denmark. How many of you are from Denmark? I feel there's like more people from Denmark watching this than I've seen watch any other thing. But apparently a lot of people watch the... Um, 
the, the Tuesday live streams that I do with Joshua and all that. It's a gold brick. Give it to me. Give it. There we go. So this is kind of weird. Oh, 200. Wow. Okay. Um, that there's like in between levels to like the actual chapters as well. So this might be one of those. I forget. Does it say this? Yeah, this is an in between level. So we got to head on through here. That's a character unlock for Ron from Hogwarts. Oh, boy. Uh, Way 2 says, well, yo, love your channel. Thank you, man. It's not my channel, but I'm sure you like Beyond the Brick, so thank you for that. Uh, can you play other LEGO games? Well, I played I played Complete Saga last week. I'm playing this one this week. I'm getting, I'm working through it. Give me some time here, all right? Give me some time. You know, I'd rather be this guy. Well, I'd rather not get eaten by a couch, but I'd rather be... Oh, okay. I was going to say I'd rather be that guy, like, uh, taking a nap on the couch there, but... If he's going to get crumpled up into a ball, I'm going to say no on that one. Um, they could include DLC for Rogue One and Solo a Star Wars Story. Or more importantly, Mandalorian. More importantly, Mandalorian. But I agree. Any DLC involving that stuff would be great. Um, we need a remake of Gringot Goblets. Goblins? Yes, we do. Absolutely. We need a remake of, like, everything. Okay, so I gotta cast a spell. Give me your pants. Eat that up. There we go. Uh, can you play Lego Marvel next Thursday stream? Well, I'm probably gonna finish this game and then dive into uh, something else after that. Probably not years 5 through 7. I would probably say 5 through 7 uh, if I'm able to when the actual sets come out, but we'll see. Uh, Mandalorian would be amazing and bring me back to a Lego Star Wars games. Well, uh, plot twist, if you buy... Uh, the Razor Crest, uh, allegedly, there's going to be some, uh, some something involving that. Oh, that's a big puppy. That's a puppy. Never mind. Uh-oh. I really hope Lego do a Super Mario Lego movie. Anything would be better than the terrible 90s Mario movie. What are your thoughts? I agree. Wholeheartedly agree. I think you'd sooner see a Mario game. I think that just makes more sense, or the most sense, rather. Hey, man. You open up for me? No. Wait, this. No. Uh, Scabbers, is that the deal? I guess not. Okay. Go back to Ron. Go back to Ron. Wait. Oh, no, you got to chase after him. Oh. Hey, but uh, I guess not. Okay. Oops. Hey, you like that Lego Marvel movie? You like that um, Mario movie? You like the 90s movie, Cafe Con Lego? That that makes one of you. That's, that's only you. On that one. Uh, what do you think of the new clone? I have not seen the new Clone Wars. Uh, I have made it very known throughout these uh, uh, streams I've been doing. I am not the most diehard Star Wars fan. So if you're looking for the hot takes on Star Wars, you're not going to get them here, ladies and gentlemen. You have to go somewhere else for them, unfortunately. My, my expertise lies in more so in Harry Potter and Mario and all that. Um, let's see. This channel is really nostalgic. Thank you. That movie, it's a thing. That's all I can say about it. Yeah, it's definitely a thing. That, uh, that Mario movie from the 90s. I don't know about that one. I've seen it, uh, once or twice, I think. Yeah. Uh, what's your favorite Lego game? Well, I might be doing a video on actually that, so I'm not going to spoil that here. But, hey, uh, we'll see. Uh, what's your favorite Harry Potter movie? Rowan, it's number three. The Prisoner of Azkaban, by far, is my favorite. Uh, that's what got me back into the series, or into the series in general. So I, I was absolutely enthralled when that movie uh, was seen by me. I loved it so much. Honestly, didn't know the game existed. Makes me want to buy it, though. Oh, yeah. This game is actually 10 years old, believe it or not. They have a collection of years. Oh, I got to cast a spell on the painting. There we go. Um, there's a collection of years, uh, 1 through 4 and 5 through 7 together. So uh, a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Uh, Constable Dickey says, what's a Harry Potter? Great question. I uh, couldn't tell you. No idea whatsoever. <laughs> what is this pot of Harry? you're talking about here huh what do you mean I have no clue 
That, I'm assuming, does nothing. It does nothing. Alrighty. Oh, gotta assemble the knight. Can I... I, I need to grab that. There we go. It's like a minifigure brick building extravaganza. There we go. There we go. Who's your favorite Harry Potter character? Lupin. I definitely can say, since I saw three, I really like Lupin. So I was very excited when uh, he was released with the uh, Hogwarts uh, Express set last year, two years ago. Two years ago? Wow. Time flies, ladies and gentlemen. Time waits for no one. Um, so yeah, what's my favorite color? Uh, uh, magenta. It's definitely magenta. It, Mr. Ghost? Is that, um, uh, nearly headless Nick? It's, he's not very nearly headless, but you know, that's okay. All right, so, uh, purple? Is there no purple? Well, there's blue. Uh, blue. Wait, no, it's this one over here. Duh. I didn't realize the base was actually over here. Get this away. Over here real quick. There we go. Oh, no, I have to move it over. Oh, I know what I need to do. Okay, move this. I thought I needed to place it in the center because I'm not really paying attention. Here we go. There's that. One. Count it out loud with me, chat. Here we go. One. 45. 63. There we go. What's my Hogwarts house? Ah, man. I don't know. I I think by definition I would be a Gryffindor. Even though I may not necessarily want to be a Gryffindor. I, I mean, maybe I would fall more into a Hufflepuff or Gryffindor depending on what. I'm definitely... No oh, okay. Okay. All right. Yeah, I'm definitely not a Slytherin or uh, anything like that. So, uh, I, yeah, I probably fall more with the uh, the Gryffindor squad. Got to reorganize these books. Restore the knowledge. Right? Is that good? Yep, that's good. There it is. Oh, it's the crest being repaired. Ah, uh, yes. Of course. Uh, what's your favorite Lego set? I don't know. I have no clue. <laughs> Uh, we'll see if I end up playing Lego Indiana Jones. Uh, I don't know what'll come next. We'll figure it out. This guy definitely isn't evil. He's not evil at all. What are you talking about? Uh-oh. Oh, we need that big orc back. We don't have him. He's actually pretty terrifying. So we need him. We need, uh, Fluffy. We need uh, a couple of the, the bigger uh, figures. But otherwise, not still going. Out of the dungeon. It's this one here. Uh, oh, that's a big boy. There he is. Miso want the chicken leg. Hmm. And scabber time. Scabbers definitely isn't evil either. What are you talking about, chat? What are you talking about? Scabbers is totally fine. He's fine. Hey, Bricks, do you like the ship in a bottle set? I do. I haven't uh, had a chance to buy it yet, but no. Uh, I, I like it. Uh, hey, Brian, how you doing? Dorothy, I'm doing good. Thank you for asking. How you doing? Hey, Orc, you good? What is his goal? You know, where is he going? What does he want? He wants the world, clearly. There, there he goes. All right. So, uh, do we know the order or do we care? We don't know the order. Or what is... Oh, scabbers. No, we don't need scabbers right now. Uh, that is... What is this? You would think... So, this one, I actually don't know as much on how to play. So, forgive me for being uh, ignorant. Oh, Ron can't learn it. He doesn't know it yet. Only Harry knows it. Oh... Oops. Well, that takes care of that one. Here we go. What does this do? I don't know. Uh, oh, this. Back in... Oh, the fish go back in the water. Okay. I'm like, why, what would be the point of doing that? There we go. 
Does this do anything else? No? I might be stuck. Who knows? Uh, Brian, do you like the Hagrid's Hut? Yes, I do. From Prisoner of Azkaban. Of course I do. I love all of the Harry Potter sets. Every single one of them. I'm definitely a fan of. In general. Overall. I have every single one. The only thing I don't have is the book from Harry Potter. Uh, the one that has the um, updated uh, Tom Riddle. Uh, that one I do not have. Uh, the crest is back. Yes, it is. Uh, what do I do? I'm kind of stuck. Okay, that's one way to solve your problem. He does. You can switch between the spells. Oh, you're right. Ah, uh, yes. Ah, you're so smart, ladies and gentlemen. You're so smart. Thank you. <laughs> uh, have you built your own levels in Gringotts? No, I have not. I didn't even know you could do that. What do I do? Uh, buy Hyrule Turtle. Uh, is it this? No. Uh, have a good day. I'm feeling sick, so I gotta go. Bye, Brian. Bye. See you later. Big brain chat indeed. Let's go. I'm not seeing what to do. Do I have to look? I, I'm not. I don't want to have to look up a guide for this, really. I really don't want to have to do that, but I don't know what to do. So when I initially played this, I uh, I had to do a. Oh wait, it doesn't involve this. No, I, I can't do that. Not right now. Uh, I do like Lego Hidden Side a lot, actually. It's very cool. What do I do? Uh, the torch on the step? The torch on what step? On that? Uh, probably the knights. Probably the knights, but I don't know what the knights do. Wait, does it involve scabbers? Wait. Do I need to use scabbers again? I probably do, actually. Here we go. All right. Scab it all up. Yeah, it involves scabbers going all the way to the right side. Yeah. I just got way too ahead of myself. Oops. Oops. Thanks for the help, though, chat. We're in this together. Nope, that's not it. Use the torch? What torch? Make the El Fuego set review? We'll see. We will see. That's not it. I thought I had it. Oops. What, what do I do? Vision, help! <laughs> what do I do? Do I need to go back up there and do it? Uh, back over here, yeah. Oh! Oh! I do this for a living. Ladies and gentlemen, I play video games for a living, I promise. I promise. I'm so sorry. Yep, sorry about, th okay. Thank you, Cafe Con Lego. <laughs> oh, you know what you're doing. I, I just thought you turned the torch on. I didn't think you actually did anything with it. But oh well. I guess no humans are welcome in there, that's disappointing. What about the chrome thing in front of the fountain? I thought you needed to repair the fountain or something. But that wasn't it. There's that. Who's a, is that some fresh dry cleaning? It is. Yeah. Hey, can I have some uh, dry cleaning? Can we get some dry cleaning. Uh. I want to be a uh, Slytherin real quick. No? What? Okay, I guess not. All right. Uh, oh, you. No. You. Oh, those two combined. Ooh. A little sword fighting action. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Okay. Okay. Oh, wait. Then you go over here, right? There we go. Thank you. Oh, now I'm in disguise. Ooh. Wait, am I in disguise yet? No? I don't know. Hey, uh, I got to run sub to you. Uh, thank you very much for subscribing to the channel, Bricks O'Brain. <laughs> I am Bricks O'Brain. And uh, thank you, Way2, for that. Ladies, welcome. Use the 8-bit spell. I wish I could, Stud Sidious. That's unfortunately not how this works. Un unfortunately, no. 
Uh, I actually did a complete playthrough of LEGO City Undercover before, so I've actually played through that game twice. Brick's so smart boy. Oh, yeah. You! Is Hermione okay? Or is she a cat yet? I can't tell. No, she's definitely not. Okay. Uh oh. Hey, 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 big boy. There you go. Talk to me over here. Let's fight it out. I remember seeing this on discount at like a stop and shop years ago. It's a whole big thing. Uh, 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 what? What? There's Hermione. She's safe though. It's fine. Clean up. No, no cleaning time. Okay. Uh, man, they're really, he's just having a, having a ball here. All right. Very nice. I saved someone. That's good. I'll have to fight, uh, Walmart, the evil, uh, boss and level up my Lego parts. There you go. Good luck, Stud Sidious. Good luck indeed. There's one. What a bang. Get all the coins. There's no coins. Only studs here. Only studs. What's he going to do? What you going to do? Huh? Throw it at me? Yeah. Okay. Do your worst. All right. Do your absolute worst. No, you can't. There it is. No, it's pizza time. I wish it was pizza time, actually. Unfortunately, it is not. And then... Doink? Get him. Wait. That does not work. Okay, I thought it might work. What? How do you... What? Up high? Down low? Too slow? How do I not know how to do this? Drop it. Drop it like it's hot? No. The wall is... The wall is falling on a troll in LEGO City. Oh, no. Don't forget to hit the like button. Exactly. Uh, they need to make older LEGO games Switch compatible. These, this, this one is on Switch. You can absolutely get this one on Switch. What am I doing wrong? Uh-oh. Oh, no. He's just going to stand there. Stand there very menacingly. Uh, this is on the PC. This one right here. Cafe Con Lego. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. What do I do? I thought I... I did that before! What are you talking about? I did that before, and it was like, oh, no, we don't register that. I guess that didn't work the first time. Oh, this massive trout here. Is this your fault? More like, is this your fault? Snape always speaks very, uh, uh, softly, in a way. Softly, but author with authority. It's usually how it goes. And yes, Adam, you were right. It just didn't register when I did that the first time. Gosh darn it. Drag. Level complete, free play unlocked. There's one crest there. The person in peril. Let's continue the story on this one. So yeah, there's always like a level in between. With all this. Uh, what joypad are you using? I am using the Xbox Series 2 Elite controller because I'm a tryhard. So that one is a very, very expensive controller that I use for pretty much everything, uh, thankfully. So it's not just one thing that I'm doing. I can use it for Fortnite. I can use it for any PC game, really. So it's very, very good. Uh, but yeah, it is quite pricey. If you can get it on a sale, it actually works out even better for you. What are you going to teach me today? Teach me a little spell about uh, levitation, will you? Ooh, uh, uh, a lesson on how to get funky. Ooh. What year are you on? Year one. Just started year one. And I'll get uh, probably to year two today. So years one and two will be this stream, and then uh, three and four next stream. All right, Lumios. Now you can now hold Y to select different spells. Why? Oh, yeah, why? Okay, cool. Uh, I could do that before, though, but I just didn't realize it. All right, so I think it's B. Nope, it's X for the ability. Nope, okay, we'll see. Uh, you go where? Oh, yeah, way over here. And you repair the center, correct? Yes, you do. 
Look at that. Nice. Uh, are you doing okay during these times? I am. I am doing okay during these times. It's a little uh, stressful not being able to see my friends as frequently as I, you know, used to before. But that's really the worst of how it is for, um, you know, right now. So thankfully, I'm doing okay. Not uh, not doing too bad, but thank you for asking. Uh, Cafe Con Lego with the $2 super chat. Give me a second here while I got the hype horns for you, Cafe Con Lego. Thank you very much for that. All the uh, super chats go to uh, the apparently the Bricks O'Brien Lunch Fund or the um, Harry Potter Not Being Able to Climb Up a Stairs Fund. Whichever one comes first, really. So thank you for that, Cafe Con Lego. Uh, do you eat gamer grub? No. Uh, if by gamer grub you mean like Chipotle, then yes. I just had Chipotle uh, before doing this stream here. So that's uh, about the extent of my gamer grub as of recent. Okay, let's get these guys out of here. Give me all these pieces. All of them. Done. Th wait, no. Let the light bestow upon you. Good. All right, so can I just grab multiple at a time? Nope, they don't hold on to it. Okay, cool. Noted. Have to go back up and grab each one every time. That's okay, though. I get it. You know? Here we go. Let there be light. Come on. Get out of here. Good. Um, let's see. I'm definitely going to get this for my Switch. There you go. Exactly. You're very welcome. It's a, it's a good game. All the, all the LEGO games are quite lengthy. So make sure you're ready to... Uh, Play them for quite a long time, but they definitely are fun. So you're definitely getting your uh, money's worth out of them when you're playing them, though. Um, I was playing LEGO Star Wars Complete Saga before this stream. There you go. I played LEGO Star Wars The Complete Saga uh, last time. I did uh, the entire original, or rather the prequels, and then I did the original trilogy uh, last stream. That was pretty cool. Lumos! Lumos! has been achieved. Oh. Um, you can switch your character who's on the top ledge so that you don't have to go back down every time. Well, unfortunately, I already solved it. So I think that uh, advice appeared a little bit too late. Sorry about that. But uh, thank you for the information. And Lumos. There we go. Now you let me pass through, no problem. A Lego Goonies game would be bananas. But you do have the Goonies uh, Dimensions Pack. So you do get at least a level, which is good. It's better than nothing. Not ideal, but better than nothing. Will you do the Skywalker Saga? Maybe. I usually like doing videos on these games. There's typically a lot of downtime in between each of them. So doing a live stream like this for me gets a little, not exhausting, but you know, it's just a lot to handle. So we'll see. Ideally, by the time that comes out, that there's gonna be more conventions that uh, Josh and John can go to that we don't need to do these streams anymore to, you know, kill a little bit of time here. Sorry, we need the three ingredients. I remember this actually giving me a lot of trouble. So I may, Maybe need help. Maybe. this It's all coming back to me now. So this this might be an issue. All right, we'll see. I certainly hope not, but we will see. And I don't think these actually do anything. So there's no use in me doing that, for real. Um, I need to get the potion to do that. Okay. And for, oh, that's a snake. Okay. Oh, I'd love a Lego Goonies. It's my favorite movie. Um, Goonies is good. I'm not, uh, that's one of the 80s movies I actually missed. So I have not seen that yet. Eventually, I will, though. Uh, this looks interesting. Uh, considering that you are Harry Potter, I would certainly hope it is interesting for you. Hello. Uh, what was your, your favorite LEGO Star Wars A Complete Saga level? I don't know. Um, the one involving Jabba Sailbarge? Is definitely one of my favorites. So it, it probably is one of those. Flapping the gums. Oh, they're, they're little butterflies. Okay, cool. Um, I forget where I... There's a skeleton. Did this give me trouble before? Really? 
No, it must have been some other section then. Because that was pretty easy to find. Just snap his arm off. It's fine. Just, just snap his arm off. It's all good. Give me a little bit of that potion. A little bit of that, that drank. Here we go. You, that, that's exactly what it's like when you drink uh, seltzer water, ladies and gentlemen. You just get, just like that, you know. Ileana, I'm wearing your shirt today. Yay! Oh, thank you, Ileana. Uh, the Bricks O'Brien shirt, which you can get if you go to my shop, but it's not about me today. But thank you. Um, did I miss the memo? What? We go through here, right? That's it? No, that must have been it, right? Is this where I messed up before? Where I was like, oh, now I don't know where to go. Uh, R.I.P. Skeleton. Oh, yeah, rip that skeleton. That, uh, he got his arms absolutely turned, turned off. Yup. Gonzo. Uh, Gryffindor, my profile picture should be Harry Potter. It should. The cauldron looks like it'd be spewing out gold studs. It does. It definitely does, but not quite. Okay, the snake doesn't do anything. I thought we could go through- Wait, I definitely missed it while I wasn't paying attention. I'm sorry. Where do I go? It's a collaborative effort, chat. Collaborative effort. These guys down here? No, nope, can't go through there. It is, but it's not showing. What? Oh, there we go. Through there. This random doorway that's off screen. It's like, why? What? But, you know, that would have messed me up a lot when I was younger. Because I, I, like, who would have thought to go in that one particular corner? It's like, really? Like, oh, okay. Sure thing. What is this? It's a bunch of drumsticks. There you go. And it turns out per, uh, Pierce Prevent. It doesn't involve the potion, but that's okay. And what's good is that all these um, areas are actually unlocked for next time. So we never have to go through here again. So that's good. Or we do, it's just not, uh, not, you know, we're not doing the same process again. I should, is it saved? It should be saved. I'm 3% of the way through. Oh boy. All right. Oh, he's getting picked on. That's not good. All right. Let's go a little Lumos here. Lumos. Does it actually clear out vines in the movie? I forget. I feel like it doesn't. I don't remember seeing that. Uh, wow, you're the only person that has pronounced my name right. Because I'm cultured, Pierce. Ah, get him out. Get, stop. There we go. Thank you. Because I am very cultured, so you're lucky. No, not that culture. But, you know, I, I, I try my best. That's all you can do. Do the potions cost studs to buy? No, they do not. The potions just cost the standard um, fee of assembling the potion together. Oh, snap. Lock your ears, chat. Lock your ears. This is what all you sound like when you ask for shout outs. Are you ready? Ready for this? <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. They took him hostage. Oh no. No? Oh, I guess not. Oh, that that's the next section, I think. Oh. Uh, yes, and it can be used as light. Uh, okay. Gotcha. Well, let's save Ron. Uh, first of all, let's go with this. Uh, you, nope, get, get this, need to make sure I always have the right one selected here, okay, no, activate with B, right, you can target objects by pressing X, oh, okay, oh, it's just that simple, all right, no, it's not, okay, over here, right, yes, okay, we gotta actually get rid of all of them, okay, there we go. Get this card out of here first. In the movies, Lumos just emits light. Yeah, that's what I thought. I, I don't. I, I didn't think it like got rid of these random plant monsters, but you know, whatever goes in Harry Potter goes. I'm I'm down for it. You know, Sprout smelling smiling like nothing happened. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. All right, get this. Is that the only one here? That's the only one here. 
Come on. No, where else am I looking? Oh, I can use RB to switch between them? Oh, that's cool. This one level made me furious. Why? Is it because you can't figure out what to do? Am I on the same page as everyone else? There we go. What? I'm sorry. What did I do to you? Why did you why did you freeze me? I never freeze. What's the deal, lady? Can I donate on this? You can. Uh what house are you? I am a Gryffindor. Of course. Oh, did I accidentally attack her? Is that why? Oh. Uh, that might have been it. Okay, anything around here? I need to assemble the cart. And the cart needs to crash through there. That's what I need to do. That's not very apparent. All right. But it's not very apparent at all. What are you doing, robot? Uh, that's very sp specific, but okay. When I did this level, I got stuck at the start. Well, I got stuck at the start too, so that makes two of us. Yoink. There we go. That's making two of us. Like, who would have thought you got to crash through a wall? Who would have thought that'd be the case? Lumos! Lumos! There we go. Uh, Mandrake, Sheik. <laughs> uh, you would know Harry Potter and the Prisoner of Azkaban when uh, Azkaban opens when Harry is studying Lumos Maxima. Yes. You're right. I cost an arm and a leg. Hello, Mike. Cool Factor Mike. How are you, man? Happy uh, Thursday? Today's Thursday, right? I think. What's going on, man? How you doing? How's life? On the sunny west coast? And this still isn't even the beginning of the level. Like, we are in between levels right now, you know? Uh, these games are free. No, they're not. They are not free. I bought this on Steam for $20. So that's what I did. This is a level, though. Neville, the one true hero. Can you believe that I actually didn't have that spoiled for me? That whole ending did not have spoiled at all. I was totally unspoiled by that. All, like, years. I went, like... I saw the movies two years ago. Never had that spoiled. Uh, the most you can donate in Super Chat is $500. All right, so somebody step up. <laughs> no, don't do that. Don't do that unless you really want to. Uh, hold A to fly upwards. Hold. I'm holding A. No? I guess not. Oh, no, Harry is the only one that can. Because he is the professional, right? Yeah, that's why. Yeah. Only Harry can fly well on a broom, Anakin. Uh, wh who is saying nah nah? Who is doing that? And how do I lower myself? Do I even know? Or is that... What? Get off of there. Um... Let's see. A switch to Harry. Oh, I did switch to Harry. No, I'm good. I knew that one. Okay, so this, we go up here, yeah. Oh, the orb. Give me the orb. Oh, it's the it's the goblin. Oh, I'm like, wh who? What? I didn't even see the goblin back there. It kind of like blended in. Goblin. How did you put your name in the goblet of fire? Get over here. Mr. Goblet. Mr. Goblin. Okay, you lower, you higher with A and lower with the right, left trigger. Okay. How much did I miss? You missed about an uh, you missed an hour, and also the uh, the game crashed one time, so you missed uh, just about that. Uh, not really much of anything, if I'm being totally honest with you. I played about three levels, I think. Technically, I'm not sure. Is this guy gonna die in like two movies, three movies? You caught the globe, Harry. Harry, you caught the globe. Oh, that Harry boy. He's so legendary. It's a shame his parents had to die at the hand of Voldemort. It's such a shame. 
Sorry, we missed uh, some. We went shopping for Gamer Grandma. It's okay, Shayna. How are you? Hey, yes. There we go. Uh, so yeah. Uh, who's a goblin? Who's a go who's a good goblin? Yes, he is. Yes, he is. Who's a good goblin? Uh, Lumos time. So, uh, what's everybody's favorite movies? What's everybody's favorite Harry Potter movies? While I'm sitting here doing the in-betweens of some of these levels, right? What, what's your uh, favorite Harry Potter movies? Lumos? Lumos? Come on. Lumos? There we go. There's one. There's two. Goblet of, Goblet of fire because it's fire. Well, yeah, I can't argue with that logic, man. That's a, a good one. I, I didn't like Goblet of Fire as much as three, but I appreciate that it's like an event. It's like something to do, you know. Uh, here we go into here, right? Yep. Only very strong characters can pull the chain. I've never seen them, but you're just spoiled like three of them. Well, it's all, <laughs> David. It's also about like the journey of the movies and the, the things to do. So, like, like me talking about the movies is not as bad. Like, it's not as bad as some, like, other things that get spoiled. So, you're still good. Don't worry. You're still totally fine. Here we go. I need the little piece. Where's the last piece? Is it in these bushes? No. Okay. Uh, it's in here. I see. There we go. Nice. I feel like the first time this took way too long to figure out, but yeah, that's just me. Prisoner of Azkaban, good choice. Um, get the bone and put it in the pot. Oh, I know. Now I got it, though. And now that can roll and roll and roll and roll and roll. There it is. Brian, do you cook? And if so, are you good at it? I do not cook. Uh, I am not a very good cook, I must admit. Uh, I wish I was a bit more, uh, you know, better of a cook, and I cannot fly. Oh, I can fly across. Well, that's very aggressive, Hermione. She's, like, at a heavy metal concert level. <laughs> like, that, that's just being a bit overdramatic, don't you think? That's a little overdramatic. It's like, all right, sure. I'll cook for you then. Well, thank you. I appreciate the uh, consideration. All right, so this one is the uh, the Quidditch match, obviously. Headbanging LMAO. Yeah, oh yeah. Just saying your chat is delayed quite a bit. It is delayed because it's on slow mode. So slow mode is uh, because there's so many people who chat. And I want to make sure I keep track of the chat as best I can. So that has to be uh, the thing. And maybe you were delayed. <laughs> Willie the dude. Maybe you're delayed. Brian, what's my favorite sport? Uh, sleeping. Is this game for Xbox One? Uh, yes. It is on Xbox One. Uh, I only have it for the PC. Uh, the Hogwarts Lego set did not include this part. What do you mean? There's, um... Oh, the big one? Yeah, it did not. Um, which I'm surprised by. It included Hagrid's hut, though. So... I'm surprised that only 112 people are watching. Well, I don't really pay attention to who's watching. Or how many people. You know? As long as people are having a good time with it, it's all that matters. And, you know, we're still getting into the whole live streaming thing. So, you know... I'm very used to it over on my Twitch channel, but Beyond the Brick typically only does one live stream a year, which is the uh, Creations for Charity 24-hour stream. So that's the thing. As you live stream and do more things on your channel, okay, uh, more people know about uh, what's going on, you know? And, okay. Do we want to have Hermione headbang her way across this way? Works like a charm every time. There we go. You have a Discord? No. Not available to the public, no. Which makes me sound I'm a lot more important than I actually am, but a lot of people... 
Uh, it's not available to the public. Uh, sorry about that. No, but like a lot of people ask me for my Discord. I'm like, ah, no. And Isaac said he doesn't give away his Discord because Isaac is one true fan. Thanks, Isaac. How about you do this again, but it's this time it's Star Wars. Well, if you literally watch last week's live stream, you would see that, film boss. Uh, Brian, who's my favorite Harry Potter character? It's, um... I was going to think of a joke, but I couldn't think of a joke character. Uh, it's, uh, Lupin. It is Lupin. There we go. It's stairs time. What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Stairs O'Brien here, coming at you with the hottest stairs gameplay you've ever seen in your gosh darn life. Now, if you like this stairs content and you want to see more content based on more stairs across the galaxy, make sure you absolutely decimate that like button with all of your might. Because the more that you like this video, the more stairs I'll be able to cover. Uh, in Harry Potter games or otherwise. Uh, you know, Escalators is the tier three on the uh, the Patreon, so don't uh, don't get too ahead of yourself. Stars, potions, moon. Star, potion, moon, that. What a crazy puzzle. Wow. You do this again, but with Lego Indiana Jones. Brian, can you do this again? Except it's Back to the Future. Brian, can you do this again? Except it's, um, except it's Lego Harry Potter. It's like, what? What? I'm, I am crying. Brian sounds like Andy Man Morgs. I don't know who that is. Hey, hey, hey. Stop it. Stop it. I know social distancing is a thing, but come on. Get, hey, get this chump out of here. Oh, I'm just going to walk in place on this one platform. See you later. You're welcome. The werewolf professor. Oh, yeah, absolutely, Star Wars boy. Uh, would a Jedi smoke a wizard? Ooh. I feel like... Uh, that's a good one. Actually, I have no idea. I think the wizard would win just because the Jedi can use the Force, but, like... You know, a wizard can, like, summon new objects into existence, you know? Just makes more sense. Hey, can you do something? No? Okay. I guess not. Uh, let's solve the riddle, kids! Ocean, moon, stars. Say it with me. What? What's the next one? Moon? But what about the next? Is this Dora? <laughs> I am. I have called myself the Lego Door the Explorer before, or rather, the video game Door Explorer. So, I will. I will gladly take that title. Do you want? Uh, I don't know if I would lose viewers or gain viewers if it was like, all right, I'm gonna wait until people in the chat respond with what comes next, just like in Dora. Like, no, no, no. We're gonna wait. We're gonna. Wait. We're gonna wait and see what happens. Uh oh. That's some arson material happening over here. Wizard can appreciate, uh, can appreciate behind Jedi. What? I uh, turn to page 394 because I want to expose Lupin. Yeah. Dora O'Brien. What's going on, kids? It's your boy, Explorer Dora O'Brien here coming at you. Thoughts on the live action Dora movie? I guess it's fine. Can we get 200 likes? Are we not at 200 likes? What's going on here? I know y'all like Star Wars more, but come on. If you want to see more of these pretty decent live streams, like in the stream is the best way to do that. Level complete, bada bam. What level am I on? Four? Four or three? I'm glad I decided only to cover movies one and two because th these I knew were going to take a lot longer. Harry Potter's better than Star Wars. There you go. Um, I love this game. I do too. I'm liking this. I'm enjoying it. Hey, are you are you guys enjoying the uh, the stream? Like in general, you don't have to like the video or anything, but like, do you guys enjoy these streams? I hope you do. Cause otherwise, I don't know what I'd be doing. I don't know what 
You guys would be doing. Uh, where's Hermione? We have to have headbang and Hermione. Wait, no, we can just repair the bridge. Nice. No, Harry. No. Great stream as always. Thank you. Well, Craig, you're biased. Now, now you're a part of the family. You're a part of the live stream and family, all right? This stream is definitely very decent. Beyond the brick approved. There it is. Brian's game crashes on the final level and sends it back to the start. Let's certainly hope that doesn't happen. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Everywhere you go. But the prettiest sight to see. Sing it with me, kids, is the holly that will be right within your heart. A pair of hop along boots and a pistol that shoots as it wished for Barney and Ben. Dolls that will talk and will go for a walk is the hope for Janice and Jen. That I feel like that would be like there's gonna be some mumble rapper who's gonna take that and like do a Christmas album. Look at a pair of hop along boots with a pistol that shoots as a wish for Barney and Ben. Like just something like someone's gonna do it. Not me, but someone's gonna do it. That's the next Fortnite event, is uh, Travis Scott singing uh, Beginning to Look a Lot Like Christmas. It's a giant 50-foot tall version of Travis Scott. Mm. <laughs> uh, loving the stream and your beautiful face, Brian. Thanks, Trent. Love you, too. The only important characters in Hogwarts are Harry, Ron, so they were the only ones that got presents. <laughs> That's true. Uh, Craig asking, when is your album coming out, Brian? After the book and before the movie. So it's it's gonna go, uh, book, movie, no, no, uh, uh, book, book two, mo book, blah, blah, blah. book one, book two, album, movie, TV series, late night talk show, animated show, in that order. <laughs> in that exact order. I have deals for almost none of those. Most of those. But uh, that, that's where I'm at. Why am I invisible? Who knows? I'm the invisible man. I'm the invisible man. What about action figures? Well, I do have a Bricks O'Brien minifigure. So action figures, maybe not. But I do have a, a minifigure that I had custom printed. That is available for people to buy, if they would so like. But that is not what I promote on here. That is the thing, though. Harry! Jump, Harry! Get get off of this cloak! Get off of this cloak. Let me go. There we go. Ba boing Ba boing Bricks O'Brien blanket. Oh, uh, listen, anything's possible, Isaac. You know this. Mr. Dragon! Hello! You! The statue is dabbing. Um, it's bowing, not dabbing. Not everything is a dab, kids. I d that does not look like ice. Uh, they call them action figures because they literally do nothing. You got a point, man. You do have a point. Uh. Oh, you're gonna snap my head off? Thanks. Wow. Appreciated. All right. Uh, no, don't eat me. Don't you eat me. Don't you eat me. Okay, you're going to eat me. Bricks O'Brien plushies. They, so I've actually looked into that before. It, it is very expensive to get that to happen. And, like, you need to make a bunch of them at one time. The minifigure makes a lot more sense. Trust me. I've, I've thought about this uh, extensively. No, don't eat my head. Okay. That ice looks worse. Then ice means uh, man's Lego. It, ice man and Lego marble. Yeah, I gotcha. All right, let me back up here again. Or no? In here, maybe? No, okay, that's one way to solve your problem. A pair of hop along boots and a, like it was Christmas for 30 seconds in Harry Potter, and they're like, I guess never mind. No pistols that shoot this time. Okay. Uh. Let's see, perfect timing for this stream then? Hey. Exactly. Ooh, that's 10,000 studs. Nice. Show off your minifigure for everyone, Brian. Ah, uh, do I have it on me? Uh. 
I'd have to change the uh, camera angle here, but it looks like this. Uh, is it going to work? I don't think it'll work. No, it's not going to work. But I do have a, a, a minifigure. It's right here. This guy right here. It's a whole big thing. I think it's pretty cool. Uh, big screen. No, it, it won't even be in focus, Craig, unfortunately. Shoot! Don't eat my head. Do not eat my head. There we go. Okay. Thank you, yes. Uh, turn invisible to fight the book. You said it first. It's cloak time. Oh, I need to I need to do the thing. Yes, I got I got to do this first. Okay. So if I jump over here. No! Nope. Okay. This Then I go over there. Okay. Evil book, I know, right? Everyone loves plush plushies. Yeah, oh yeah. Absolutely. All right, what about this? Okay, so you don't eat Ron, but you eat me. Okay. Is it cuz he's a ginger? Is that why? That's not fair. Come on, man. Yeah, but what do I do with this stuff? Oh, okay. Cool. So all three of them are up here. That doesn't make any sense. Where do I go? I need to clearly do this. Oh, it wouldn't lock on before. That's why. All right. There we go. One. Count with me, kids. No, don't stop eating me. Stop eating me. I'm not that appetizing, I promise. I promise. The books want you with your parents. Yeah, right? They want the whole family together. Yeah, this book does not care about Ron. Does not... Eh, I guess the book does care about Ron. Okay. Oh, Hermione's a cat. I forgot. Cool. All right. And that... Uh, that little piece of uh, uh, ice cream is not up here anymore. When well, you're trying to read a restricted book, but it eats your head. <laughs> it just munches on your head a little bit. It's fine. So what if a book gnaws on your head a little bit? It builds character, right? It's fine. Great stream. Please post the stream later so I can watch the rest later. Oh, by the way, you reached 200 likes. I did. Ooh, thank you very much, Pierce. Uh, the stream will be posted after the fact. Don't you worry. If you want to watch the whole thing in full, if you miss any part of it. And that's awkward. That's awkward. Okay. So if you miss any part of it, and you want to uh, watch it back, you totally can. Uh, yeah, you know, it's the whole thing. Uh, where does this go? Who knows? Bouncing books. Bow, bow, bow. All right. Now this one goes with the purple, right? And this one goes with the magenta. There we go. It's a key. Be right back. There you go. Uh, Declan asking, can we get to 250 likes? I don't know. Do you believe in this audience more than I do? Tune in tonight at 9 on ABC Family to find out. <laughs> just, just wandering. He's just like walking up to the door. Dumbledore. That's great. All right. So we are not able to open that, but that's fine. Scabbers. Scabbers, no. I, <laughs> I was going to say a line right there, but I'm not going <laughs> to. I'll save that one for my stream. <laughs> that was, that's okay. Uh, he has to float the key. His hands don't work. That's true. Are we almost done with the movie? Wow. Nearly or totally had let's snick there. Hello. There's another crest. We always find the Slytherin one first. So we got to find uh, the, the means to unlock the mirror of reflection. Uh... Is it the cloak? Cloaksy. No? Yeah? Is it that? No? Why am I so lost with this whole process? How many people are waiting for the new Skywalker Saga game? I mean, I am. Looks pretty good. 
Got to destroy the spider? No. Can't do that. Oh, Lumos! Lumos! Get him out of here. Oh, the bats get rid of it. Oh, yes. How could I forget? One, two, yeah, yeah. It's like you're my mirror. Oh, my mirror staring back at me. Oh, whoa. Oh, that's the foreshadowing, kids. Hmm. <coughs> Sir. <sighs> Dun, 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 dun. Mm. What do you think of the new Harry Potter sets? Woody, I love them. I absolutely mm. adore those sets. Mm. What is this orange stone? What is this stone? Oh. That was that level wasn't even that long. It was like two rooms. I just feel like it took a while. Which is okay. That happened. See, the books wanted the kids with the parents, exactly. <laughs> they didn't care about uh, the the uh, stepchild, Ron. They didn't care about him at all. I'm assuming you mean this way. Let's hope so. Yes. Okay. I will probably play Harry Potter 5 through 7 once the uh, sets come out in August. If I'm not covering them or something, who knows. But years 1 through 4 is first, one step at a time. I'm going to get this set with Hagrid's brother. Oh, that's going to be a good one. I'm looking forward to getting every... August 1st, I'm basically going into debt between all of the Mario sets and all of the Harry Potter sets. I am unfathomably excited for that. Uh, Haggy's brother, they have that for a oh. set. I feel like you meant mm. to say Hag Hagrid's instead of saying Haggy's because that sounds kind of wrong. Mm. Uh, yes, Hagrid's brother is a... Uh, big figure character thing, like in, uh, Giant Man, and... What's the thing from Wonder Woman? Whatever it was from Wonder Woman, that thing. And the Ninjago character, yeah. Can we get a super chat to support Brian's Lego funds for the summer? You don't have to support it here. You don't have to do that. Oh, the half giant? Yes, the half giant. Even though Dumbledore is half giant, I think. I think he actually is. He's a troll half brother. Oh, okay. It's a Pegasus. I'm gonna eat you! Is that Voldemort? Voldy. Oh no. It's the beacon. Brian, did you notice Hagrid's fingers? No. I am not looking at Hagrid's fingers. That That is not where my attention is drawn to when I'm playing video games. Let me look at this guy's fingers real quick. Not quite. My 217 likes, Brian. Nice. Thank you, Luke. Thank you for the update. Again, I never like to focus on numbers and stuff. It's just usually a, a good way to show support for the stream by liking the video. Because, um, yeah. You know what fascinated me, ladies and gentlemen? You know you know how I knew this game was good and I had to get into Harry Potter? You wanna know how I knew? Because the dog can climb stairs. Look at this. The dog can climb stairs and ladders. How is that normal? This dog is next level, okay? The point is his minifigure has fingers, it does. Oh, it's got like the indentations for fingers. Oh, I get you. I, I was not drawn to that. <laughs> That's why I bought the game. Because <laughs> the dog can climb ladders. That's great. Get off of here. Can I get rid of this? No. Keep popping out wasps, I guess. It's not. At this rate, Harry's already dead. Oh, yeah, no, he's totally super dead. Super duper dead. He can do. He cannot do Lumos. Wow. All right. What about you, Lumos? And Doggy. What's his name? What's his name? Chat. It doesn't actually say on here. 
what his name is, which is very... Don't, don't hurt my dog. Not, or Hagrid's dog. Don't you dare. He's the best boy. Don't you even dare. Don't you even dare. Fang, yes, his name is Fang. Thank you very much, Lucas. Wow. That, the dog just like terraformed the earth. Amazing. But yeah, Harry's definitely like super dead. <laughs> Baltimore definitely got him. It's all over. End of the books. Barks O'Brien. Oh, yeah. There we go. Well, I can't get through there. Because I need to be evil. And although Ron is a ginger, he is not evil. Not as far as I know. Uh, wait. Can the dog attack? Oh, the dog can't attack. Nice. Fang can't attack. Nice. All right. Not that this really does any... Really? Okay, sure. Hit you with my umbrella. Ella. Ella. A. 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 Under my... Actually, Ron has the most abilities. So oh, wait. No, I need to actually attack. I, I need to attack with that instead of doing that there, but okay. Oh, I can just go through here, right? No, I yes, I totally can. Why did I think I needed the red to get through there? What am I talking about? Like, <laughs> all gingers are evil. I wouldn't say that. I've known some pretty cool uh, red-headed people. So it's all good. Some of you are probably out there watching right now. Who knows? Ryan, how often do you go to karaoke? That's kind of a loaded question. Which you wouldn't, <laughs> you wouldn't think that's a loaded question. But hey, I guess it's something to talk about, right? So... And this is what usually happens in my videos, just so you know. And in my live streams and whatnot. Usually it gets to the point where it's like, alright. Doing a lot of the same thing. Talk about interesting stuff. So, with with me and karaoke, I have never been to an actual karaoke night. Like, a traditional karaoke night. But a thing that I guess is popular, that I didn't know was a, a popular thing, and I guess it's popular in Japan, is going to karaoke... And instead of performing on a stage in front of a bunch of other people, you rent a room with your friend, your friends, and sing karaoke just amongst the group of you. Which, to me, sounds uh, not appealing. Because I think the idea behind karaoke is that you do have a bunch of people with you. And, you know, it's kind of that public embarrassment thing. Like, oh, we're not supposed to be singing because we're awful at it but oh we're just gonna sing and all that but this is apparently a thing that people do and i've been a part of it and i'm like all right it's kind of whatever it's not really my preferred way to do karaoke but um that's a thing i don't know if anyone here has actually done that but yeah it's totally a thing people do uh hagrid you are summoned sir um let's see it sounds like sounds better than strangers though but the idea behind karaoke is that it is embarrassing, right? Like, you wouldn't, wouldn't you want it to be embarrassing with a bunch of other people that are hanging out with you as well? You know? Like, you just kind of have fun with it in that way? Like, all you just singing in a room. Maybe it's because I do this stuff often enough that I'm talking to myself in a room all the time. That, like, it doesn't have as much appeal to me, personally. But, I don't know. It's a very uh, weird concept. It happens at uh, round one. There's one like an hour south of here that I've been to a couple of times. That's usually what, uh, if we end up going and hanging out with uh, friends down toward that way, it's usually what happens. Blue Mouse, Blue Mouse, Mr. Spider, you're gone. See ya. Uh, how do I get up there? This way, this way, this way. Yes, yes indeed. Your friends will say nice things, but strangers will judge. Well, but that's the whole point. The whole point is you're like, oh, this is, you know, this is cringy. You know, why are we doing this? Like, I don't know. It just seems to take away the, the I guess, the fun aspect of it. I don't know. Kind of not really. Harry, please don't be dead. Harry sees, uh... Wait, why do you have to help Harry if the centaur comes and helps him? Oh, great question. I don't know. I have a headache. No. Thank you, centaur with anime hair. 
I love you. <laughs> Hello, lady. <gasps> Agree that is the point. Thank you, Craig. Well, Voldemort has now consumed Harry's life force and takes over Harry's body. Yes, indeed. Replay has been unlocked. Here we go. This should be the last level, right? I need a rock band game bar. Now that sounds like a good time. Oh yeah. That, that sounds like actually a very good time. Like if everyone plays instruments and all that. Once uh, society goes back to normal, that would be a, a key, key thing there. That'd be pretty cool. There we go. Up toward this way. Thank you. Wait, did his neck just do a 130 degree angle? You talking about me? Oh, no, I, I like crack my back because this uh, chair is still awful. So. Oh. There was a dog thing you missed. Oops. Sorry, Declan. I am more focused on actually beating the level than getting all the collectibles because you have to bring other characters with you to beat the levels. Do, do, do. Th that's what you sound like a karaoke, Ron. Yep, stop. Fluffy does not appreciate your awful singing. Hey, bathtub man, let's go. Doggy want a bone? There. Who's a good puppy? Who's a good puppy? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. I guess you're not. Okay. Uh, Ron, help! Oh, he's big. That's a big. You want you want the puppy? Yes, you do. Yes, you do. That's how I sound in the band. Yeah, there you go, Luke. Fluffy is a big bro of Fang. He might be. That's not confirmed, but I wouldn't be surprised. Thank you. Thank you for not eating me. That'd be a much better solution than what they did in the movie. Sing. Uh, take a little nappy nap. Yeah, there you go. Your eyes are still open, but that's fine. That's all good. Thank you. That's my puppy. Yes, he is. It's a good pup. Lumos. What's in the box? Can we unbox this? Unboxing time on Beyond the Brick? Nope. No unboxing here. Nope. It's You literally cannot do it. Oh, actually, we might have to do that. All right. Hold on. Do this. Lumos. Lumos. And a la 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 Lumos. Lumos. Come on. Hello. I guess not. No. There you go. One, two, three, four. Nice. Uh, Lumos Solemn. Now we're good. Down through this way. That's how you do it. I don't think you need to use the, um, like the home in ability on the Lumos to actually get them, but it makes the most sense. Room of the Flying Keys. Here we go. Reminds me of a, uh, a level from, like, one of those old Nickelodeon shows. It just, it sounds like that would be a thing. I don't know if that makes any sense. Like, you'd have to summon all the flying keys to get to the next room. On, like, Legends of the Hidden Temple. Like, that sort of a thing. I get that. Really? Oh, I guess not. All right. Uh, up here? No. Which LEGO game is the best? I really like LEGO Dimensions. That's one of my favorites of all time. Uh... How about, oh, excuse me, sir. I need your broom, sir. Broom time. Yep. Oh, he got to pop the thing on his head. <laughs> okay, so I definitely need Harry for this one. Wow. He just took the, the biggest tumble there. All right. Uh, not going to work out for him, but oh, well. There we go. Yep. And he's just, he's just collapsed. He's, he's just taking a nice little nap real quick, man. He's feeling pretty good. And there it is. Who here remembers Rugrats? I love Rugrats. One of my first games I ever played was uh, Rugrats in Paris on the Nintendo 64. What a time that was. 
All right, so clearly I have to play chess somewhere around here. If you get defeated, I know. I'm sorry. There we go. We got to get the queen. The queen. You're a streamer who plays old Lego games, Brian. I play a lot more than that, trust me. I play uh, a lot of games on my Twitch channel three days a week. Tomorrow's Fortnite, Friday's at five. So that's a whole thing, ouch. Oh, he's gone. Come on. Oh, I have to actually get in it? Oh, cool. Yoink, see ya. <laughs> I have the uh, Rugrats Game Boy game. Ooh. I never played the Game Boy game. But I played Rugrats in Paris, and I also played the other Rugrats games that were on the N64, the party board, the party ones, which was actually kind of weird. Like, why would there be a Rugrats party game? But it was actually pretty fun from what I remember. So uh, I played those. Those were fun. Use Ron on the black horse. Hey, look how smart you are. Thank you very much for that one, As Asher. I was going to say Aster because I know an Aster, but you're Asher. All right. Next up. Uh, luckily, you do not have to do this in actual chess order. Otherwise, this would be that much more uh, difficult to do. It's a king. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. Can't see this. Can't see this. What's going on? Take my sword, Anakin. I mean, Harry. Oh, no. Really? That's what stopped you? Okay. I'm looking in the mirror, and it turns out, Harry, you should look in this mirror too, and you know what I see? I see a stone, and it turns out, I have a face on the back of my head. Oh, wow. Who could have guessed? Hey, does anyone else uh, out there watching right now have a face on the back of their head and are secretly very evil? Either or. A column A, column B situation. Who, uh, who's evil here, you know? Anyone? One quick question. Why is there lava under a school? You know, I, you're asking way too many questions. Um, I think you're putting way too much thought into this one in particular. Is he, are you the green goblin? <laughs> you just have these green skulls. You're launching at me. And I don't think I've died one time this entire playthrough. As I'm about to die, who knows? There we go. Get out of here. Wait, can only Harry attack? Why did I do a, a, a 720 no-scope right there? <laughs> that was a 720, man. Why? This is weird. Uh, why is Hermione in this scene? Because you need uh, an ability for a second player here. You need to have an excuse for player two to do something. Because so all these LEGO games are meant to be played multiplayer in some capacity. And every time I use that attack while he's wandering around, it doesn't do anything. So I gotta not use that while he's walking back. Come on. One. Yep. There we go. There it is. Harry! There we go. I'm taking your life force from you, sir. Are we sure that it's not Voldemort is wearing his shirt backwards? Good point. Very good point. He just might be wearing, you know, you might be able to see the tag on the back of his shirt. I didn't think of that, but you got a point. Hey, there we go. Nice. One, two. Why is there lava under the school? Give me your face, sir. Not my face. That's all my mother loves me for. No. Big nose pop. There you go. Um, she's not supposed to be. Yeah, she's definitely not supposed to be in this scene. And... Can we get 2,030 likes? We might be able to, man, at this rate. I don't see why not. Whoa, there we go. And give me your face. Uh, give me your nose. And give me your nose. Actually, you don't have a nose. Your hand. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I don't have any limbs. Whoa. Harry, Ron, or Hermione are in the underworld because Fluffy was Cerberus. Voldemort is Hades. It works out. They have are in the underworld. Uh-oh. 
Oh, he can't take it because he's a ghost. Yo, Denny Phantom, he was just 14. Gotta catch him all because he's Denny Phantom. Gotta catch him all because he's a Denny Phantom. I got your nose. Yes, I do. There's one movie down, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to continue the story and go on to level or, or, or movie two. Then we're going to be getting out of here. But that is uh, the Sorcerer's Stone. It's a different name in UK. I think, and everywhere else except the U.S. <coughs> Big nose hair. Hey, none of these guys have noses. Technically. <laughs> Where's Dumbledore? <laughs> when your parents are approved, you killing a man with your bare hands. That's a good one, Greg. That is a good one. He didn't destroy the stone. No! Mm. He did not. <sighs> it's the Philosopher's Stone in the UK. Exactly. <laughs> Lego Harry Potter. Oh, it's almost like I'm playing the game again. There you go. Is there um, a difference in the books between the Philosopher's Stone and all that? I think that's a, a trailer for uh, Indiana Jones. I think. Um... Begin year two, sure. Lego. We're going to be with the Dursleys again. My favorite people. You can't use any magic here, boy. I am too big to catch you doing magic, so I'm going to gorge myself on your cake for your birthday. Dobby. Dobby loves Harry Potter. Dobby. I have a sock. Where does the sock come from? I don't know, Mr. Potter. But you need to go back to Hogwarts. I'm not going back. No, but Dobby says you need to go back. Dobby loves to smack his head on a cupboard. Like, why does he do that? It's too much. Too much. And he runs throughout the house. That's not going to solve anything. Dobby loves cake. Is this Neapolitan flavor? This is actually the set as well. That is uh, newly released. Or new, going to be newly released. Oh, he doesn't want him to go back to Hogwarts? I, I haven't seen that movie in so long. I should probably watch these movies again. I probably should have watched one and two last night to catch up. but Or refresh myself, rather. Why well, he has a barbed wire fence around his house? That's a bit much. Couldn't Harry... Couldn't Harry, like, teleport through it? Ron, you don't know how to drive that thing. Uh, uh, Harry, it's fine. Let's go. Let me just remove all the windows on your house. Real quick. Ron, save Harry. Dobby disobeys Master Harry. Disobeys rules. A man has fallen into the bushes. <laughs> In Privet Drive. Hey! That's a set, too. Ron's brothers were driving? No, it was Ron driving. It's Ron and Harry. Oh, the owl covers his eyes. Nice. Jump, Harry. Fred and George should have been in that car. They should have been, but they're irresponsible. So, makes sense. Hey, McLeod, how you doing, Brian? I'm doing good. I am yay deep into an iced coffee. So I'm holding up. Doing okay. Continuing my way through uh, Lego Harry Potter years one through four. This is year two. In the movie, his brothers were. His brothers were not driving in the beginning of two. They, they definitely were not. Unless I have everything misconstrued here. I, I do not believe that they were in control of the car. What was the saddest fatality in the Battle of Hogwarts? Um, no, uh, no one really surprised me. I mean, I, I forget which of the brothers. Is it Fred or George? That was pretty sad. Um, oh, hello, Ron. Huh? Um, there's also... I mean, I, I didn't like him when Lupin died, but, you know, hey, it happens, I guess. Huh? I guess 
That's fine. There we go. Um, because he had a kid, right? That that's kind of sad. So, the tractor was in the Lego Star Wars game. There you go. In the movie, Fred and George drive to the Dursleys' house. I, I, I then I must be wrong. I'm sorry. I just I do I thought it was Ron in charge of the whole thing, because he drives like garbage. Or am I thinking a different movie? I must be thinking of a different movie then. Oh, there she is! Yay! She, why was she hiding in a stack of books? And do we not have a Ginny minifigure of the newer series uh. of uh, of sets? And Fred died. Okay. Sorry, Dave. I keep spoiling all the movies. Oops. She can use magic. No, really? Oh, she's too young. Okay. I forgot. Let's get out of here, kids. Let's get consumed by the green fire. Ron rode in the back seat. Okay. Ron told Fred and George and to come and help. Okay. So, like, I, 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 I know. Kind of. Oh. Oops. Floop pad. I wish I could use that in real life. Ron and Harry are alone when they miss the express. You must be remembering that. That must be it. Oh, and they have to... Then they fly the car to the express, right? Uh, who's your favorite character? Dobby. No, that's a lie. <laughs> that's a lie. That's a bull face lie. I still haven't seen Harry Potter, but I don't mind the spoilers. Then you're coming to the right place. Who's that mysterious stranger? Who has big feet? It's Steve Harvey. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Steve Harvey in Lego Harry Potter years one through four. Can you believe it? Because I can't. There we go. Oh. Oh, this is the book, right? <laughs> you love how I'm like remembering things in like the weirdest ways. Oh, this is the one with the book. What are your thoughts on Malfoy? So the my issue with Malfoy. Oh, it's in the mirror. Uh, I'm like, what is he pulling on? It's just air. Okay. Um. The issue with Malfoy is that they never give him a proper redemption arc that his character definitely, I feel like, needs. So, like, the movies just kind of end with him being a brat, which I understand that, too. But I feel like he could have redeemed himself in some way to, like, disobey his parents or, or something. In some capacity, something. Right? The plot needed Hagrid to be in that room at the same time Harry just arrived. Exactly. It's just convenient for the plot. And if you think it's anything else and you're thinking about it too much. Do I poke the, the eye? Oh, it's a sword. Be gone, smog. Get sliced and diced. Can we get some Fs in the chat for the, the Hungarian horntail here? Jeez. That that's sad, but you know it happened. Oh, where did Ron go? He um he combusted. Uh, oh look, this looks completely different than Lego Star Wars: A Complete Saga. Well, Kevin, if you had paid attention to the thumbnail, you would see it says Lego Harry Potter. But you know, I don't expect you to catch those little details. Uh, you may be some graphic designer, but that doesn't mean you need. Okay, uh, that doesn't mean you need to pay attention to everything. You know, but uh, thank you for tuning in. Hope you're having a good day. Do you like the Deathly Hallows movies? Oh, yeah. Absolutely. Totally. Malfoy had a child called Scorpius Malfoy. That is the most evil-sounding name that I've ever heard in my life, besides the name Joshua Hanlon. There's Lucius Malfoy and Joshua Hanlon, the two most sinister names I've ever heard of in my life. I'm aware of the social commentary on how most all these games are copies of each other. Oh! You know, Kevin, you said it, not me. <laughs> you said it, not me. They, they get more... So, these get different soon. But for a little while, yeah. What's your favorite Harry Potter set from the most recent wave? The most recent iteration? I really like the Hogwarts Express, but I'm obligated to say the Hogwarts Castle, right? 
<laughs> this chat is going to eat Kevin alive. They aim and might. <laughs> 10 likes away from 250. Oh, boy. That JPEG is oddly crisp. That's quarter of the day. I'm going to kill that Harry Potter. If I were a wizard, that's how I would do all my spells. I would talk normally like this and just be like, I'd go from sounding like Brian to Palpatine in like five seconds. You, DeRoy Lockhart, is such a liar. Filthy liar. Oh, this one has a snake. Can I can I go on uh, a tangent here? This is what I'm thinking of. Yes, you're right. You're right. Yes. So I got the right movie, right? This game is 10 years old. Can somebody explain to me why? Can somebody? Somebody explain to me. Why they haven't made a Chamber of Secrets yet? In Lego of the most recent iteration of Harry Potter? Can somebody tell me why? It's the most logical thing that could possibly happen for this line. And guess what? The car just goes away forever. Never see the car again. Gone. Favorite character in the movies. I said it was Dobby earlier. It's the car. <laughs> and then Declan's like, well, maybe they forgot. <laughs> maybe they forgot to make... <laughs> To make a set out of one of the most important, like, scenes of one of the most important movies in Harry Potter. Maybe they forgot. Maybe. I can't tell you why it's a secret. Hey, if anyone wants to give me any info, let your boy know. Because companies aren't always logical. I mean, like, sometimes... I get why. Like, things don't happen, but come on. That is a given. That totally needs to happen. Like, come on. Do you have the castle set? I have every single Harry Potter set. Because I'm a tryhard. Okay, nothing I can grab over here. Uh, Lockhart steals the memories of people who had great adventures and releases those adventures in his own stories. Yes, he does. I didn't realize that kettle was right over there. Oops. Where is the thing? There we go. They are too big to get objects by themselves without using the wand. Exactly. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime girl. I think that's the lyrics. Close enough. Imagine seeing a boy running around and blowing things up. I know, right? What a crazy concept. Open the box. Nope. Okay. I guess that's a no. Um, because they included the basilisks in the Hogwarts Great Hall, LMAO. Oh, but see, that doesn't mean anything. That does not mean a single thing. You know why? Because I feel like that there's going to be um, new iterations of, like, the Phoenix and the Basilisk if they come out with an official set with those in. I feel like that's going to be a thing. Does this vacuum hold the thing? Where? I, I need you to give me the, the thing. Yeah, there we go. So I, if they do a new Phoenix, they could totally do a new Basilisk. It's fine. You like the DC universe? It's okay. The poor gentleman skeleton who got rebuilt and fell to the ground moments later. The most tragic backstory of 2020, ladies and gentlemen. You heard it here first. Why do you only have 200,000? I don't know. Why do you only have 200,000? How about that? You ever think of that one? Bet students are late to class all the time with puzzles like this. Yes, you're right. You're very right. Why is there this conveniently placed puzzle on my way to astrology? What is going on? Now is when we do the things. Now this is it. All right. That's what you all sound like when you ask for shout outs in the chat. Subscribe to my YouTube channel where I have no meaningful content. That's exactly what you sound like. Uh, I'm new what happened, so I'm playing through Lego Harry Potter uh, years 17 through 35 on the, the Xbox One Series X. So thank you for tuning in 
uh, to this uh, grand adventure here. Let me grab a pair of earphones real quick. Turn my headphones up. Louder. Where's my snare? I don't hear my snare. Shut up, kids. Trying to bully Harry Potter. That's not how that works. There we go. Constable Dickey with a $5 super chat. Thank you very much, Kevin, for that one. It's greatly appreciated. That goes to the official Bricks O'Brien Lunch Fund, in which I already got Chipotle. And I got a nice coffee, so I'm all energized, ready to go. So thank you for that. Uh, where is this last one? Oh, there he is. Get over here, little buddy. Get over here. Yeah, any super chats or any anything is appreciated. Not required, of course. You uh, showing your support by commenting and, you know, liking the stream is more than enough. But thank you, Kevin, for that. The Constable Dickie. Hogwarts professors don't care about students being late because of puzzles. I, you know, I bet. That's probably the, uh, the excuse. Why is this helicopter happening here, you know? Why? I just love this content. I'm glad that makes two of us. I'm glad. Yeah, I can't go that way. Why would anyone take the the job if it was off? I don't know. That sentence wasn't even English. I'm sorry. So, where am I going next? Point me in the direction, ghost. Thank you, ghost. Oh, I need a change real quick. Where is the wardrobe? Over here. I have the downtown diner modular set. Good for you. I do too. I have all of the modulars from the palace cinema on. That's what I have. The Skywalker saga looks good, but I haven't seen any footage of it, Ant. I've only seen the trailer they put out like months ago. I just saw the new sets. Right, William? Aren't they cool? Aren't they just the best? Very excited for them. August 1st, I am going broke, just so you all know. Uh, I will not be able to record any more videos between the Mario sets and the Lego Harry Potter sets. I will be uh, taking out a third loan on a house I don't even have. So, yeah. There's that for you. Where am I going? We reached 250 likes. That's hype. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen. It's appreciated. Here we go. Drawing a little a little witch. Nice. Thank you. Conveniently placed wardrobe is convenient. Where is this conveniently placed wardrobe? The burrow is the best of the 2020 sets. But to see the um the Patronus in a new mold. Like that uh, glittery kind of blue color is really cool. So I like that. I, I I mean, it's it's small. It's definitely small, but it's meant to be. So, it, and it can, it can also attach to the rest of Hogwarts. I don't know if you guys know that, but it can totally attach to the rest of it. It's really cool in that sense. And are you going to let me go? There we go. Nice. So you can attach it really anywhere. And hopefully they come out with smaller sets like that. That way they can attach just more little modules eventually. Dab it on the haters of this YouTube channel. Exactly. These little guys. Uh-oh, he's dead. Let's not have that happen. Let's just disable them from flying. Ron is jealous, is he? I didn't know it was a wig. Makes sense, though. All right. Press B to freeze the pixies. Freeze. Freeze frame. Or just lock onto them like that. Then do it again. There we go. Uh, cast it again to finish them off. I did. And I guess it didn't work. Why is it locking onto this guy's head? There we go. Nope. Don't aim for Ron. There we go. Nice. I hope we start seeing these animal molds used for regular variants. I mean, when Lego makes a, a mold, they typically don't use it for just one thing. 
It, it might take a little while, but they'll use it for multiple things eventually. Imagine how painful it would be to have your hair ripped right off. Oh, I know. Not great. There we go. Let's clear them all out. Get them out. Oh, oh, oh. There we go. Done. Poor Ron. Are you 25? I am 24 years old. 24 years young, if you will. And that's 16 gold bricks. Oh, boy. It's actually quite a lot, considering I've only played the game for uh, two hours. I'm assuming we go through here. That's how I scream, too. <laughs> That's how normal people scream, right? Neville should be on that chandelier. He should, but he's not. No! Don't use it for just one thing. Tell that to the camels from Prince of Persia. I know. It's not consistent in that regard, but I feel like they should. So we'll see. Mm. Uh, but the burrow has the exclusive figures like that wolf guy. Yeah, the burrow is cool. Um, I mean, the astrology tower is cool too. That cat's not having a good day. What's a normal person? Great question. No clue. Let's take notes on this dead cat here. Hmm. Ants. Ants. This guy looks evil. You can get crazy discounts on Lego games if you have it. Well, I paid $20 for this, so that w this was not on sale through Steam, so... That's how they all talk. Do you guys prefer the um, the grunts and uh, all that of these games? Or do you like the voice acting of the newer games? I think that I like the, the, um, the creativity they use to convey the story with the grunts. But I like that there's voice acting and it makes it more comprehensive. So it's kind of 50-50 split between the grunts and the voices right now. Interesting. Where do I go, man? Where do you want me to be? Over here? Hello. There we go. Ron's worst nightmare is spiders, and he's seen more spiders in Hogwarts than most people see in a year. Yeah, I think between... um. Between the grunts and the voice acting, it's a good balance. Like some, some it works out better than others, I think. But I'm, I don't mind either. Whoa! You can get this for seven ninety nine on Steam. No, you can't. Not U.S. I paid twenty bucks. Wow! That looked like that ice cream looked like concrete when it when it, when it went from like the cone and like it slapped on her face with the ice cream there it looked like concrete. They should make a Lego Toy Story game. Weren't there? So I didn't end up finishing um, Lego Incredibles. Was were there a lot of um, Pixar unlockable characters? It wasn't Toy Story probably one of them. I feel like it should have been. Hey. Let me help. You want a bottle? No? I guess that's a thing. Uh, hit the thing. There we go. What is this build? Uh, there we go. Dobby, yes. Okay, yeah. So, I mean, a Toy Story game would be really cool. And there's enough to do there that they could totally justify doing that. That'd be sweet, actually. I would play a Toy Story game. Dobby, why are you so just awful? Why are you relentlessly awful? You know? You ever think about that? Yes, there were Pixar characters. How many Pixar characters? Because I, I thought I remembered, like, seeing, like, Dory and a couple others, like, in a weird way. 
What is what is everyone else's favorite Lego game? Anyone else have a, a, a favorite? Is it Dimensions? Is it something else? Let me know. And if uh, any of the mods are watching as well, what are your favorite Lego games? You want to chime in. Get six or seven characters for the uh, Pixar characters. Nice. Indiana Jones? I heard Indiana Jones 2 was not good. Like, it only involved, like, the the fourth movie and, like, only bits and pieces of one through three. It's kind of weird. I like the Lego Harry Potter games because Harry Potter is my favorite series. You know what? That's fair. Dobby, stop running. Dobby, stop running. Stop running, Dobby. Um. Oh, over here. Cool. What's your favorite Star Wars character? Jar Jar Binks from uh, Episode 1, The Phantom Menace. In case you couldn't figure that out. Dobby, stop. Stop being obnoxious. I know it's hard. I know it's hard for you to not be obnoxious, but... Lego City Undercover. That's a very good game. One I have played more times than I thought I would, but... Uh, Lego Star Wars 3, I guess. I've never played Lego Star Wars 3. I have not seen the Clone Wars, so I feel like if I played it on here, it might uh, get a little lost on me. So I doubt that is what I'm going to play, but we'll see. Is that Dobby screaming over here? What What is going on? Dobby? Stop. Stop it. Why Jar Jar? Oh, I was, I was kidding. No, my favorite uh, Star Wars character for real, I i mean, I like the Mandalorian, so I guess I'll say the Mandalorian. I don't know. Uh, oh, you guys, okay. Like, how does someone really like Jar Jar? I mean, if someone grew up with the original, with the, um, the prequel trilogy, and they really love... Like, there are people that love the Ewoks, and they like the Ewoks more than they like, you know, uh, the, the, what are they called? The Gungans, and all sorts of stuff. They're, like, everyone likes different things, you know? I only played a little bit of The Force Unleashed, and it was okay. It, it, that type of game is not the type of game I usually play, and that looks like a very weird snitch there. So, I only played, uh, part of one and part of two, and I got bored. Why is this side level even included? It doesn't even drive the plot. So Lego games are not known for having a very extensive plot and things like that. So they made an entire level out of the 20 second scene of Rey walking up to Luke on the island in The Force Awakens. That was an entire like 20 minute level out of like 20 seconds of movie. So, yeah, they, they pull strings. They they try to, you know. <laughs> and I'm proper you can use spells that students don't learn until... Oh, okay. You can actually do a lot. Wow. All right. You're super OP. All right. Um, this Dementor spell. Yep. Okay. You cannot grab this, right? Oh, you can. Oh, wow. Nice. Cool. Obi-Wan's my favorite Star Wars character. Good choice. Man, I'm really excited for that Obi-Wan series if that ever hits the light of day. Hopefully soon. I am very excited for that one. Let's grab this first. No! There we go. Do this. We made a level where Poe gets donuts. Did they? I must have uh, stopped playing to that point. I thought I completed it like the main story, but maybe not. First out of the rest of these pieces real quick. There we go. They should make a new updated version of Lego Harry Potter game with the redesigns. I know, right? They really should. But I feel like if they were going to do that, they would have already done it, considering that uh, they remastered... They did this collection remaster, like, a couple of years ago. So I feel like we're kind of beyond that point, unfortunately. Oh, that just destroys that. Okay. Uh, I have no use for that anymore, though. Unless, uh, where's the spider and the, the thing? I don't know. 
Do you play Battlefront 2? No, I don't. Unfortunately. I know a lot of people are still very into that game, but I never really got into it. Oh, I gotta put him back. Oh. There you go, buddy. Now you're home. Safe and sound. Okay. Oh, I can break this. Right? No? I cannot. Okay. Noted. And I can't go... Oh. Duh. There's the skeleton arm. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my ragtime gal. Hit the dab. Do the... Do the floss on there. You know, if they redid... If they redid the Harry Potter games, you know this skeleton would be flossing on the bed right now. You know it. You absolutely know it. If they do that in uh, Skywalker Saga, it, it that's going to happen. It's going to be a flossing skeleton, and all you're going to be like, ah, that's cringe. That's a cringe. All right, so those two are done. Spooky, scary skeletons, indeed. Dobby! Dobby! Finally, my favorite character. Finally. Thank goodness. Peace has been restored to the galaxy. Once you complete the person, you can open the door. Yes, there we go. Yeet. Did I not need to do all that? I did not need to do all that. Huh. Okay. All right, kids. Let's figure out which one's next. Just kidding, I got it. Hermione is so pretty in this game. Well, that's a comment. Thanks for that one. We're in a wheelchair now, kids. All right. Oh, this is a level. Oh, this seems like not a level. Just based on the structure, but I guess it is. All righty. Get this cobweb out of here. Thank you. That is how you use an axe, of course. What can I do? Oh, can I do this? No. Definitely not. Definitely not. Def she's not evil, so clearly that's not going to work, Brian. Clearly it's not going to work. Oh, there we go. Oh, uh, wait. Oh, uh, there we go. I do need to use that. Okay, so all my efforts before were not useless. Okay. Um, the new LEGO Star Wars game bonus level, Skeleton Floss and Dab. Do they really? That sounds uh, interesting. Take a little bit of this here potion, Ron and Hermione. Take a little, little, little sip of this. Actually, it's just Harry. Never mind. Hey. Can we try to find Voldemort's nose? I got you a nose. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Uh, I'll probably play five through seven once the uh, the movies, not movies, the uh, sets come out in August. Ouch. He's petrified. Why is everybody so petrified? Petrified. Step aside and just drop that. Come on, drop that. Come on, drop that. Drop that. Let's stop. Bring it back. Bring it back. We got that bounce keeping us on track. Anyone know that song? Anyone? If anyone tells me that song without looking it up, $7,000 to your bank account right now. Seven grand. Who wants it? <laughs> oh, man. No idea. A lot of you are saying yes, like Seb is like, yeah, I know that song. You need to name it, Seb. You need to name it. All right, this guy's bu this guy's bugging me. Hey, stop it, little rascal! Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oops. Uh, there we go. All right, so all of you are young enough that it's not a very popular song either. It's only a very cer uh, certain circumstance that you would know that song, probably. It's okay. That's okay. So Asher got it kind of right with pet. I mean, this, the name of the song is Petrified. It's Petrified. It's a song by uh, Mike Shinoda, known as Fort Minor of Lincoln Park from the early 2000s. A lot of you would not know that song. It's like, stop, 
Bring it back, bring it back. We got mm. that bounce, keeping us on track. Like, stop, 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 mm. stop. It's a good song, good album. But this is all about Lego. All right, I know nothing about that. All right. Let's get this. Oh, it's like a tower defense. That's cool. Uh, remember when you said $3,000 worth of Lego? If you can tell me who exclusively said, I mean, really? I did, and one one person, I think, did it. I think one person did it. That was a good one. And I didn't give him $3,000, so clearly I'm a filthy liar. I mean, really. Does anyone know that reference besides uh, Isaac? What a uh, famous YouTuber, toy YouTuber, not Lego. Not Lego YouTuber. Ooh. But uh, what you took? I mean, really? That phrase? That that's some classic YouTube, if you know that one. Very classic. I was more of a Green Day fan. Oh, that's fair, Trent. Information nature hysteria is calling out to Indian America. Welcome to the new kind of tension. All across the idiot nation, everything is meant to be okay. I gotta switch, right? Come on. What? Okay. No. Go. What do I do? Clearly need to press B. Okay, so why was that not working before? Okay. But I have to go to the mall? You can't go to the mall. What are you talking about? <laughs> you can't. You literally cannot go to the mall. The best YouTube video of all time is the classic me at the zoo. That's just the oldest video ever. That's not... Like the best. Okay. There we go. Took way too long, I feel like. The mall is definitely closed. Nobody knows what that one is, too? That's Jeepers Media. That's another classic. In my opinion, I can go. It's not a matter of opinion. The mall is objectively closed. Switch between the different spells. <laughs> Emma Cloud was like, I'm just typing that. I was just thinking that. If only the wizard duels were this easy in the Prisoner of Azkaban game for the GameCube. Yeah? It's snake time. I have parcel tongue. Watcha. Uh, what is that whispering? That's called parcel tongue. That is the name of the uh, language that snakes speak. Uh, or nope, that's wrong. Uh, it's how you can talk to, s or how Harry can talk to snakes more specifically. That's the uh, the language parcel tongue. Do 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 do. Uh, are you do like shooter games like Fortnite? What are you talking about? Was that sentence English? Ha sala ha la ha ha. Hello. Sala pa pa la pa pa. Oh, we got it. Okay, cool. I didn't see it. Oops. Hello. There we go. Oh, it's a snake. It's a big snake. Right? No? Oh, there we go. Never play Fortnite, I beg of you. Oops. Well, not on this YouTube channel, but I do play it on my own uh, Twitch channel. So yes, it is a thing. Sorry to disappoint you. And Fortnite is definitely not dead. Absolutely not even close, actually. What do I do here? Oh, okay. Have you played the new Lego Voltron game? That doesn't exist, so no. Oh. 
Oh, hello. Thank you. I need to go in disguise, ladies and gentlemen. Go in disguise. Hmm. 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 All right. So, where can I become one with my inner Slytherin? Over here, perhaps? Speak a little bit of the parcel tongue. The hustle ha ha ha. Parcel tongue. Do you like shooter games? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I do. I don't mind playing Fortnite and all that. They're not my favorite games of all time, but I don't mind playing them. Mm hmm. The Polyjuice Potion is next. Oh, yes, indeed. Yes, indeed. Hermione. Not his Miney, Hermione. Hi. I enjoy how there's zero talking. I'll be honest, I didn't know if there was even a Harry Potter game. And I got into Lego in 2014. Well, you're about four years too late on the in initial game uh, coming out. But, uh, you know, it's here. And it's pretty good. Ah, I need to be a Hufflepuff. Well, that's a problem. I think this one I might have had trouble with. One of these I definitely had trouble with. In some way. Okay. You like Breath of the Wild? I've actually played uh, Breath of the Wild 100%. Other than the Korok Seeds. So I am very familiar with that game extensively. And I love that game, actually. That playthrough is up on my uh, channel, if you want to see that. And uh, I would love to play some Halo, but I'm all set, man. Thank you, uh, Brian's Mice, for that one. Uh, Lego Star Wars A Complete Saga is definitely not a shooter game. That is an action-adventure, if anything, a platformer. But I don't believe... It falls under uh, a shooter at all. Not even close. What does that do? Uh-oh. Okay. There's a balloon. That's not quite what I wanted, but okay. Uh, anything else around here? There's that. Uh, there we go. Okay, so this one involving this section here. This might have been the one I was having trouble with before. I won't be able to find the cherries unless they're somewhere over here that I'm not factoring in. Which totally could be the case. But usually none of the things that involve me getting like five of something involve me actually progressing the story. Uh, let me tell you, hold on, let me figure out where this is first. Does anyone know where this might be, by chance? By happenstance, no. There's that. Is that it? That might be it, actually. Yes! Give me the cherry, the cherry tree, yeah! Nice. Ryan, tell him about the time you got hit by a car. No, that wasn't even... Like, yeah, the, oh, yeah, that was my worst injury. But, um, no, I feel like that's a story to save for my channel. You know, Harry Potter. Oh, I can become one of these guys. All right. I can be Justin Filch. Nice. Cool. Hello. Oh, hi. Polyjuice Potion on my. Rick's O'Brien struggling show at 9.30 p.m. Yes. That is the best show I could ever give you. Is me just struggling to play this video game. <laughs> There's number five there. Or it should be number five. Not that I really care about getting the uh, probably gold brick out of this one. How's it doing? We good? Yeah, it is. Oh, it's just a bunch of studs. Nice. You like the 2010 LEGO games better? Um, or after I like the pre- um, I like the post ones more. I don't have a lot of... Like, I, I've obviously played a lot of the LEGO games extensively. But in terms of, uh... You know, nostalgia for the older games. I don't really have it as much. Huh? 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 
So I would go with that. And if Lego Persona 5 existed, I would absolutely probably not play that one. I have to take a, a hard pass there, unfortunately. Toss this in here. I don't think I need to actually do this, but whatever. Where do I need to go? Nearly Headless Nick, thank you. Clean it up. Sparkle and shine. Sparkle and shine. There we go. Have you played which LEGO game is the best gameplay? LEGO Dimensions, I would say, is my favorite. Have you played a game with another LEGO YouTuber? No. I played with other YouTubers in general, but no. Here we go. I feel like there's a lot of downtime in between all these levels. There's, like, all these random, like, spots that you have to do a bunch of stuff. It's like, really? Okay. Uh, are you going to play the new Lego Star Wars? Maybe. I don't know. Depends on uh, what happens. You know? And I didn't need that duck anyways. Thanks a lot, man. All right, what do I actually need? Oh, I need to actually take apart that. That works. Just redistribute the uh, toxic gas there. That's fine. Uh, is Garfield in the game? Garfield, I can confirm, not in this LEGO game. That's a bit uh, much, if that were the case. Don't believe so. Oh, these toxic cupcakes make me sick. That's how I feel after I eat anything. It's just like... Crabbling Goyle. This is a level, right? I think. And a lot of these uh, levels involve just, like, grabbing all the stuff and putting it in the, the thing. I remember actually having to look this one up. So let's hope I don't have to do that again. Here we go. Knock it all down. Thank you. Vacation juice and the cupcakes. Yeah. Pretty much. What are your thoughts if Nintendo licensing gets so far that we see LEGO Mario Zelda video games? Um, so, what is this? Oh, it goes to a valve. Um, I personally don't think that Nintendo would allow for a Mario game in this style. As much as I love all of the LEGO games with all of my heart, all of my being an entity in the world, they are very 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 the same it's the same gameplay loop it's the same thing so if they did a lego mario game it would have to be substantially different from anything else they've done before which i just don't think they're gonna do so i don't know if that would actually even happen that would be a, a relative possibility i i am betting no but you know who knows at this point, I certainly hope so, but I don't know. There we go. That backs that one up. Nice. What if Nintendo made it? That is the dream. That is definitely the dream. I would be super down for that. Um, but we'll see. Uh, when do you Twitch stream? I Twitch stream Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. If you want to follow along with that, you can. I'll be streaming tomorrow some Fortnite, but I also play other things as well, Monday and Wednesday. So if you're not a big Fortnite fan, that's fine. Got a lot of variety there for you. But, uh, yeah. You can go to twitch.tv slash bricks O'Brien. If you want to follow with that. I gotta steal your hair, sir. Need your hair. Thank you. That was easy. And as I said before, I'll play 5 through 7, probably when the sets come out later in the year. Is this it? That's the Polyjuice, okay. Should LEGO make an indoor bunker? I'm marketing or making a mock of it if they should. Yeah, they should. Makes sense. Uh-oh. That's terrifying. 
Uh, so we're going where? Oh, I got a Lumos again. Lumos! What's in the box? What's... Okay, I guess nothing's in the box. Alrighty, then. I guess these are the disguises as well. Sure. Um... What do I do? Uh, no. No? Okay. I don't know what's going on here. Alright, so let me grab this here. Oh! That's the trick. Okay. That makes sense. Alrighty. Is that just a, a plug? A stop? Oh, it's a stop. Oh! It's Snake Charming! Oh, cool. Get this guy out of here. Or how do I even do that? Oh. I would say move the cat mine is more terrifying. It, it sounds like it, yes. No? Uh, what I might have to do, ladies and gentlemen, is end this one off here. Uh, I have to, uh, get out of here. And I don't know what the, the situation is with this and how close I am to finishing this. But I want to, yeah, I, I want to keep this at two hours and 30 minutes. So I'm actually going to leave this one off right here and, uh, pick this back up, uh, next Thursday. Because I'm getting a little... At that point. And, you know, the Hanlon said, you know, you can go until you feel comfortable and, and whatnot. So I'm kind of... Huh? So I'm going to leave this off right here. And I'll finish off uh, movie two and get through three and four and all that. So I'm just going to call it here. Uh, thank you for joining me for this live stream so far. 287 likes. Thank you for the support. It's all greatly appreciated. That's some high porns in the chat. Um, oh, I got to use Parcel Tongue. Oh, yes. So next time with Harry, I'll use Parcel Tongue and charm the snake and do all that. So yeah, thank you very much for joining me for this live stream on Beyond the Brick. If you want to follow me, you can. My name is Brian Saviano, Bricks O'Brien. I appreciate all the support, and I will see you guys and girls again um, next Tuesday for the live stream that uh, I'll be doing with uh, everyone else. I don't know who the guest is, if there's any, but uh, yeah, I appreciate you being here, and uh, thank you so much. So uh, peace out, and uh, bye. 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 Might sound crazy, but it ain't no lie, baby. Bye, 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 bye. Don't want to.